staying focused and staying at the ability to work as hard as possible every single day. It's just it's tougher than ever. Your goal should keep you up and going, and I couldn't see myself without it. I still feel like that baby of the group. I can't believe all the international competitions I've gone to and places I've been. Having to travel on your own to other countries without your parents, and you get homesick the first time, but it definitely um, makes you feel a little older. <laughs> I never thought I'd be in this place right now. 2007 Visa Championships All Around Champion. Going from the kind of like clubhouse life to the international scene, it's just, it's probably the biggest and greatest change there is. I love going anywhere with the girls. I look at them and just say, wow, we relate so well and we are like the biggest competitors but also the best of friends. There's really no negative feelings there at all. Probably the only thing that's changed is, I mean, the little girls are starting to recognize me a little more. I mean, I get a lot of hugs and, oh my gosh, that's Sean Johnson. It makes me feel like everything's starting to pay off and the hard work is really, it's working. <laughs> it makes me so excited to know that I could be a good role model for the girls and that I can show them that it can actually happen. And even a little girl from Iowa, <laughs> It can, you can actually get to the top. I love the attention and I, I can't wait for more. <laughs> when I first found out I was turning 16 the year of the Olympics, I mean, it was almost like a coincidence. I mean, it was perfect age, perfect time, and um, then to find out my coach is from the city that's being hosted, it was just, everything was like, it was crazy. I remember thinking, oh my gosh, it's three years away, it's getting close, and now it's only a year, so it's exciting, but yet starting to get really nervous. <laughs> this is, going to be an experience of a lifetime. <laughs>